Um, yeah, obviously very happy with the results today, and it was uh, really nice to see our offense come out and explode in the first inning. You know, it's no secret we've struggled offensively lately, and uh, specifically in the ACC tournament. And um, for us to come out and swing the bats like we did was just really impressive. And like I said, it took a little pressure off of everybody. It started with Mackenzie Clark, you know. I mean, she's been struggling and pressing, and just nice to see her get the line drive hit. And then, you know, they intentionally walk you know, Kago in the first inning, and of course Caroline just with a big hit right there. And that just, it, it really just got everybody pumped up. And, and um, you know, we, we just exploded from there and, and uh, had four home runs today. Um, Aaliyah, Maddie Moore, and of course Reedy here, who hit the ball hard a couple times. And um, just really impressed with our offensive output today. Um, you know, Millie came out, didn't have her good stuff today, but was good enough to keep them off balance. And then Brooke came in and pitched extremely well for us and uh, secured the run rule win. And, and just um, really happy about today. We know we got a lot of work a ahead of us and um, looking forward to, to, to tomorrow. Questions? Caroline, um, were you kind of mad when you saw him sit there and intentionally walk to get to you? I mean, with somebody like Valerie in front of you, it's kind of something you expect. It's it's not the first time it's happened this year. So I was really just ready for the opportunity to hit with runners on and make most of it. For reading your line, just how much does having had this kind of offensive explosion today, how much confidence does that, guys give, does that give you guys going forward? Um, I would say, yeah, like you said, we've kind of been struggling offensively. And I think, especially in that first inning, to come out the way we did, like that's exactly what we needed. You know, in postseason, you have to get hot to win games. And I think that gives us a lot of confidence moving forward that we know we can do it and we're, we can be back to where we were at the beginning of the season. Yeah, same thing. It's, I think that's a, a lot of momentum to take into tomorrow. And we're ready to take anything that comes at us. Jack, how much of today was momentum and that mindset that you talked about? And how much of it was? a scouting report and experience against your opponent? Well, I think definitely uh, having seen them twice in our tournament, you know, helped. Um, but like I said yesterday, I think the biggest thing for us is just being on time and our pitch selection and making good decisions at the plate. And, and I think all of our hitters did that. We had hitters coming off the bench today that, that really excelled as well. And, um, you know, it's a mindset. You know, hitting is definitely <laughs> contagious and it can go in either direction. And it's just nice to see us, you know, kind of get that weight off our shoulders and explode for a big, uh, big couple of innings today. That's a heck of a first stamp on the tournament, on your home field. Um, how can you turn that now? Uh, and just keep that ball rolling? Well, the biggest thing, I think our team is mature enough. Um, they've been here to know that today's over. You know, we're going to enjoy today's victory, but we're going to have a tough opponent tomorrow. Uh, first game of the day, Saturday, is always an important win. You know, if you win that one, you're, you're just waiting to play on Sunday. So, um, but we know both Cal State Fullerton and Auburn are, are really good teams, and uh, we're going to go watch them play right now and then get ready for tomorrow. Caroline, your home run kind of seemed to energize everyone, really got everyone going from there. Just for you, watching that ball sail out, celebrating at home plate in the middle of the you guys are having so much fun in the dugout there in that first inning. Uh, just can you walk me through your emotions there in that first? Yeah, kind of like you said, it was, it was really exciting to take kind of the pressure off in the first inning and get us ahead with a big statement. And, you know, we just kept piling it on. So like we said before, it's just great momentum and really kept the energy throughout, one, the fans, but also in our dugout. Was that the most fun you guys have had in the dugout in a while? It was up there. It definitely is <laughs> up there. <laughs> Brady, what's it like to see so – how, how does that, right? We, we've talked about momentum and mindset. How does seeing your teammates um, in front of you start to kind of just build, build on that momentum? It definitely makes my at-bats easier. You know, like when I'm going, going up there and we already have a five-run lead, I'm like, well, I mean – have nothing to lose now, like so maybe I'll just get lucky and catch one, and I did today. And so it's definitely like it definitely eases all of us, especially when we can do that in the first inning, and it builds confidence throughout the entire game. You know, I think we scored seven, two, four, and four. We didn't have to swing in the fifth inning, so I mean that's huge for us. And if we can keep swinging like that, we'll be fine. You know, Millie, uh, first inning, she didn't have command of her changeup. And uh, I thought her velocity was down a little bit. and, and uh, But she continued to work. And, um, 
you know, got out of some jams. Um, you know, she was the first one to come in and say, hey, I got to field the ground ball. And, you know, we probably would have had a double play on that ball. And then the next inning, she dropped the fly ball and was pretty embarrassed about that. But that's Millie, you know, she's able to laugh things off. And she's just such a competitor. You know what you're going to get out of Millie Thompson every day game she goes out in that circle. And, and I thought she did a great job today of not having her good stuff, but still battling and, and coming through. John, did you think, um to start the game, they you know that early in the game they would go ahead and give Valerie a free pass like that or were you surprised at all by that? I'm never surprised at what they do with Valerie. You know, I've seen people walk her with the bases loaded. So, um, you know, their coach had a strategy and, and uh, certainly it backfired because Caroline, you know, made him pay for it. But, uh, you know, it's it's just one of those things as coaches, you try to do what's best for your team. And, and I think, you know, Janelle was trying to do that in that situation. John, how cathartic is it for you as a coach to sit there and watch your team bat around in the first inning? You mentioned this week you like their approach in practice and changing some of those habits, but to see it applied to a game as quickly and successfully as it happened today. Yeah, you know, the coaching staff has put a lot of work in, um, you know, into our offense. And, uh, you know, it's always tough when, when you struggle offensively because as a coach, you can't get in there and swing the bat for them. But you try to instill confidence. You try to, you know, continue to encourage, uh, make sure they have positive self-talk. And, and then you become a fan, actually, out there at third base. So today I was just watching and enjoying everything because I know how hard, you know, this team has worked to get to this point. And, uh, you know, you just want success for them. And it was really enjoyable to see them come out and swing the bats away they did today. Any other questions? Hey, thank you all for coming out. Appreciate the support.